Good morning, everyone. It's Carrie here, and welcome back to day four of our Animal Planet themed week here with Reach Out and Read of Greater New York. I'm super excited for today because we are talking about some animals that are very near and dear to my heart. So let's start with our song and see if you can guess what animals we will be talking about. All right. You might also be able to guess because I have some additions to my animal collection. See if you can guess it. We're gonna start by flapping our wings. So do it however you want to. Good morning, all my friends, how are you? Flap your wings. Good morning, all my friends, how are you? It's time to start our day. Let's have some fun and play. Good morning, all my friends, how are you? What should we do this time? Maybe we should stomp our feet. Good morning, all my friends, how are you? Stomp your feet. Good morning, all my friends, how are you? Stomp your feet. It's time to start our day. Let's have some fun and play. Good morning, all my friends, how are you? Very good, everyone. Did you guess it? We're talking about birds today. Animals that have feathers and most of them can fly. We're talking about birds. I have my little bluebird friend here. Now, when I said most birds can fly, I meant that birds like penguins and ostriches, even though they're birds, they can't fly. It's a little bluebird today. I love looking at birds outside my window. I have seen bluebirds outside my window, as well as cardinals, which are nice red birds. I've seen doves. I've also seen a lot of black crows. We've got tons of crows around here. So I hope you guys have seen some birds outside your windows. What kind of birds are they? So in our day to talk about birds, we are going to start by reading a story called Los Pollitos, or Little Chickies. And this is a book that is in both English and Spanish. So I hope that you guys, if you don't know, already know Spanish, you learn a little bit about that language. And this, there's actually a song that goes along with it that goes like this. Los pollitos dicen pio, 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 cuando tienen hambre, cuando tienen frío. And that means that Little chicks, they go pew, pew, pew when they're hungry and when they're cold. So we have, that, we have that story for you and then we have the song coming right after. We also have a hatching trick craft that you can make with a paper plate and it actually moves up and down. So I hope you have fun with that. Our snack today is animal tracks and we've got an awesome video about this where you can use crackers and pretzels and little cheese slices to create different animal tracks. And there's a lot to learn there too. So I hope you enjoy that. And for our activity, we are going to create a bird feeder for birds out that you can hang outside and actually then watch them uh, see what if they eat the, the bird food that's in your feeder. So I hope you enjoy that as well. And as always, let's remind you about our literacy challenge of the day. We are reading a story to our furry friends either stuffed or real. So I hope you post those videos to Zigazoo and I can't wait to see them. And I have a fun fact about birds today for you. Let me bet my bird friend here. Um, I actually had a bird growing up, so I really enjoyed learning about birds. Um, birds actually are able to fly because their bones are hollow. Interesting, right? That means they don't have anything inside of it, but it's more like a more like a comb inside rather than um, solid bone. So that's what makes them really light and able to fly. Interesting, right? There's so many fun facts we can learn about birds and I hope you guys enjoy it today. All right, have fun on your animal adventure.